Hi, I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats at the Telefilm Tea Lounge in downtown Toronto with producer Ada Solomon. How does it feel to have your feature film, Child's Pose, screening here at the festival? Well, it's always amazing to have a film in Toronto Film Festival because it's such a warm audience and they are so eager to, to discuss your film afterwards. And for us, it's really very uh, powerful to, to get all these reactions from a completely different culture and so far away from home. And uh, the, the reactions that we had so far, uh, they were fantastic. I mean, the film was not only sold out, but the Q&As could have last for one hour if we were allowed and uh, and the, the questions were very much in respect of the of the story and of the on the meanings that we wanted to to transmit with the film and it's it's really very honoring to to be here and uh, it gives you it's it charges me every time with a lot of good vibes and this film has been sold in many many countries what's the exact number around the world for now it's over 35 territories yeah what do you think makes this film and the story so universal i think that um the family relations are somehow the same all over the world and it's a film about a mother and the son and it's set in a particular in the particular case of nowadays romania but the story, it's the story that can be placed anywhere around the world and uh, um, so far everyone really related with, uh, w with this kind of relation and somehow they detached of the setting of the film and uh, really got into the story and putting... Because this is also something that re interests me a lot when, when I'm making movies that are not just movies to, to entertain or to, to, to give emotions, but to raise questions. And I think that is a film that really makes you wonder what about me and what about my family relations and am I doing okay? Um, so if this goal is achieved, then then we, we really touched our, our goal. And there's been a lot of talk about the female protagonist in the film and what a great role it has been. What do you think makes it's such a fantastic role for a female actress. Well, I think it's not every day that we, we see 60 years old main characters in the movies. That's one thing. And then she is a fantastic actress. Uh, the role was somehow written for her and she was working a lot with a director and with a co-script writer, Razman Radulescu, uh, to, to build the, the character and and her amazing talent it's it's really very uh, and it's also very very authentic the way that she's she's bringing to to the screen the the character uh, and she's a fantastic actress i mean people that are remembering out of the romanian films uh, in the last decade uh, the death of mr lazarescu definitely remembers her from there but here it's a completely different uh, character but it's so very powerful out of the out of her acting and out of the of the power of the script and the out authenticity of the script what was it like for you winning the golden bear award at the berlin film festival well that was yeah somehow so far the, the the peak of my of my career uh, but it was built in time and and somehow it's it's something very very nice to to see how the bricks are adding to the wall and it's not only our uh, our success it's a continuing success of the Romanian cinema because everything was built during the time with uh, Corneliu Porumboiu with Cristian Mungiu winning the Pandor a couple of years ago uh, with Christy Puyu being uh, in the in the um, spotlight of the press all around the world um, and, and all this bunch of Romanian filmmakers brought the, the Romanian cinema on the top that is today and got the interest and fortunately the talents that are involved in our films maintain this level of quality.
And what is it like to have this film as the Rom as the Romanian entry for the Academy Awards as well? Well, that's a huge responsibility, of course, and uh, we'll see. It's it's very challenging. It's very exciting in the same time, and uh, we, we we are we are we did our best actually. <laughs> From now on, is just to to be able to to charm the the members of the academy, and uh, to make them relate to our film as much. But the competition is difficult, uh, as usual, and. Um, the film is there. <laughs> we will see. Well, thank you so much. Congratulations and enjoy the rest of your stay in Toronto. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm Katie Allman reporting for Katie Chats at the Telefilm Tea Lounge in downtown Toronto.